Okay, welcome back, and here's where I'm at with the Doom Scythe. I got it primed, and all I have to do is decide what colors I'm going to use, and I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to airbrush this main body uh, black, and then maybe um, these tips here with gold, and then airbrush gold on it. Uh, I'm not too sure yet. I might go one step back and do up to here with the gold and then I'm going to airbrush uh, this part gold and the underneath gold and the weapons I haven't really decided uh, what I'm going to do. I might um, I'll just figure out that as I go. Okay so here's how I did my ghost arc and as you can see right there that's what I might plan on doing is highlighting all those with that kind of style. So that's kind of the idea I have. Um, it, it's fairly simple, but um, I like this. I like it, so that's what I think I'll do. So, other than that, um, that's my progress on both of the Doom size I'm working on. So once that's, uh, I get maybe the priming of the black then I'll come back and show you what it looks like or not priming but uh, painting the black airbrushing it uh, show you what it looks like all right I'm back I've airbrushed the black on my doom scythe as you can see top and bottom have been done what I've done here is painted Vallejo model air gold on just the tips there you can see and then in between here I used uh, the steel Vallejo steel model air and uh, painted in there I also used the same color for the pilot and the model air gold for this um, the control and this is what I've so far completed with the gun now I'll show you what I've done here. I used, again, Vallejo Model Air Gold. Sprayed it all down. Then I did a highlight with, I think, 3 to 1 gold with uh, the steel. And just did around the edges. It's very faint. Uh, uh, you might be able to tell. Uh, I can't, uh, not really sure if it's picking it up. But I did the front part all around the edges, the top here, a bit down these little ridges here, and here. So that's so far what I've done uh, with that. And it doesn't look too bad. I think once I get uh, the whole thing complete, it'll look a lot better. So there we have the bottom piece. And just did very little highlights because it's underneath and mostly shadows so I just did it around this area is I'm going to give the engines kind of a green glow effect I'm gonna spray the green in there or paint dark green in there and then highlight it up and then make this a really light green and kind of um, spray it on with all the parts on I'm gonna see how that turns out that's what I'm hoping to there you have it that's uh, what I've been doing. I have two of these on the go, so uh, they're both uh, at the same stage. And that's about it. So I'll just come back and uh, show you what's going on after I've got it all together. Or after I've completed those parts of it.